you know, earlier. I'm sorry, say again? There's a, I was saying there's a, had a bit of development on the, what I told you about earlier, like an hour ago. Something like that. Okay, what have you learned? What? Could we take it up into the keep or something? You'll understand when I tell you. But I probably not say it. Hmm. Alright, I have no problem with that. Fiber? Fiber? Notices. <laughs> oh, damn, it's foggy. <laughs> hmm. Odd place to leave, mm -hmm. Dragon. Yeah, around here. What's up? Oh, you want to go this? I think that means. Change it to me. Yes, D has been working to bring some life back into them a bit. With her touch, the gardens are starting to regrow. Right. Um. Okay. Here's what I was going to write. Right. I'm not 100% sure, but it's, it's something I believe to be true. And what does this pertain to? The breaking or...? Uh, I believe it's... I'm talking about the, uh, the breaking. I, I've seen... I mean, I know Orin is involved and he's sleeping at Castle and when he, when he wakes I'll deal with him, but no, this pertains to the... To the attempt on your life that we were talking about. Yes, I believe Davos is involved, so, if anything. He used to reside here in Sunspear, yeah, so he was my steward. And he, uh, I, was, I was told that he uh, spent a bit of time in uh, Bravos. And uh, in which case, that reminds me of. Um, you're, you're, are you religious princess? I don't think it's kind of hard to ask like that, but... Well, my family has been followers of the Seven for many generations, if that's what you're asking. Oh, no. Not really, I'm just curious. I'm, I myself am... I, uh... worship the many face god. Well, we have the popular saying in Bravo, so... Vala Mogulis. Which means uh, all men must die. And, uh, well, hopefully, I, you know. Isn't there another saying to that? Vala Dahares? Or something of the sort? Exactly. Mm -hmm. All men must die. Yeah. No, I, uh,. I mean, I also believe it has something to do with, uh, I mean, um, oh, sorry, I'm, I'm a bit confused, I'm super got really sick still, it's kind of annoying, but, uh, yeah, you, I remember that I was supposed to talk to you about this, um, 
the day of uh, Tucker's death, so when he got attacked by Ogre. Could you give like, a bit more details on what happened? Who asked you to talk to me about this? Not me, no. uh, because well, Tucker was my friend. And that was pretty much it. And uh, I've heard rumors. And I wanted to make sure of you. Say the truth. Or not. If it was true that Tucker got his fatal blow here, yes, that is true. I was in the horse barn like you saw me. I left the doors open, yeah. and that's when Aubrey Ross snuck up. He told me I probably should not keep my doors open. And he told me the same things that you usually come to tell me. Malcolm Terrell has yeah. it in for my life. But shortly after, that's when the party came in of talkers. The master of law, he just wanted to deliver a warrant. But then when he realized that the man who came to speak to me was Aubrey Rose, that is when they beckoned me to go back inside the stable, and that's when swords started swinging. I see. I heard screaming, it seemed like one of my thornies was getting involved yeah. in the fight, so that's when I came back out to try to whistle it off. But last thing I heard was Tugger's voice flying, and then I look over to the tavern steps and he's lying there emotionless, and his men had to drag him out. Yeah, no, I think, um, well, it's, it's like, I mean, I understand now, I think I'll get a bit of a clearer picture, but, uh, yeah, um, oh yeah, so, about the attempt, I believe, uh, it's not, it's not actually Davos or Kaiden. Are you sure? Yes. Who is he then? I... Me. I'm sorry? It's me. You made it up? No. I am... Um... The one that was sent to kill you. Why? Ah, uh, many reasons. You. Well, as far as I've been told, treason. Watching my friend die, that's enough for me. I'm sorry, Princess. So you're going to kill me then? Aye. The Darius, no. Oh. What? 